Well, hello guys, and um, I just wanted to show you guys um, a purchase I just made today. Um, so hello everybody, welcome to the vlog, welcome to the last 10 minutes of the day. I'm going to be here for 15 minutes, as you guys can see, I own this game, Explore, Venture to the Islands in the Sky. Craft and construct fantastic weapons and vehicles. Create. Brave with the cataclysm, cataclysm in Hyrule. Discover. I give you guys The Legend of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom. So, hello everybody, it's Friday. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the, uh, the vlog of me flying around on... Um, me flying around on the emulator, well, not the emulator, but Microsoft Flight Simulator. Um, so yeah, guys, I am, and I'm playing it a little bit. And I will show you guys that I'm not lying, that I've just not gotten the cartridge. Um, that is it on the system there. Um, oh yeah, by the way, I meant to, I meant to say this, guys. These hoary, um, these hoary clickers are a godsend and i think i'm going to be using these uh these extra paddles for um i think i'm going to be using these extra <sighs> paddles for um for legend of zelda probably i'm going to assign buttons and stuff like that i'm going to find out how to do that um with hori i it for, for 50 bucks um i do i do recommend this um for 50 bucks um it's very very um it's it was a very cool it was a very good purchase um so um one thing i'm gonna do is i'm gonna actually go in the kitchen because my phone is running out of juice so i'm not gonna be able to record much longer so so yeah i picked this up this this evening when i went to my target store and i actually went to go um do some stuff um so i had to i i had to pick this up and i had to pick a couple other things up because so yeah guys um i'm actually gonna put the i have the charging cord right here my mom's my mother's so so yeah um So, so yeah, I'm recording to you guys in 4K. So I've played maybe 10 minutes of the game. I've played maybe 10 minutes of the game. Uh, I actually like it. So, um, so yeah, so I've recorded, so I've done 10 minutes of the game. I'm not going to record any footage because um, I'm currently using the setup upstairs for my um for my switch, um, not for my switch, but for my, um, but for my, uh, Xbox stuff. So I'm just going to prompt you guys up here so I can talk to you guys and, um, just let you guys know. So, so yeah, guys, hello everybody. I hope you guys just like that intro. I like the intro to this game. I think it's going to be good. I think it's going to be worth hundreds of hours. So, um, so yeah, I picked it up because I have not owned I, I own two Legend of Zelda games. I own three Legend of Zelda games now. I own uh, Majora's Mask and um and um The Legend of Zelda. Um I forget the name of it, but I own two of the but I own two of the early Legend of Zelda games. I own um I own the one where you have the flute, uh, and you can do, 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 you know, 
uh, for the 3DS. Um, yeah, I own Majora's Mask and um, the um, the original. I actually like uh, Legend of Zelda, and um, Zelda's been around. For those of you guys who do not know, for those of you guys who are younger, uh, Legend of Zelda has been around since like the 80s. Um, Legend of Zelda started out as a um, as a 2D flat screen, as a 2D um, is a 2D, um, not even a 2D, just, just a flat screen on a, on the Nintendo, uh, entertainment system. You can get Majora's Mask and you can get, um, and you can also get, um, the other one. I'm misfiring on the, I'm misfiring on the second one. You guys can, um, correct me in the comment section if you guys wish, um, about the second one, um, about the second one, uh, so, I know it's, I know it's Legend of Zelda, um, Majora's Mask, and then Legend of Zelda, um, forget the other one, I've owned, I own the first two, I don't own Breath of the Wild, I don't, I, I've heard things about Breath of the Wild, but you can't find it anymore without paying, like, a million dollars for it, um, this was 74 dollars, um, I could have gotten this on the ePlay store, but on the Play Store. Um, but problem is, they'll make consoles running out of uh, running out of uh, running out of uh, space. And I wanted to get a disc, and I wanted the Legend of Zelda game to be on my to be on a cartridge ver versus a Pokemon game not being on a cartridge. Most of my games are digital, but I wanted the Legend of Zelda, my first Legend of Zelda on. My first official new Legend of Zelda. I've never had a new Legend of Zelda. I've had I had two of the old remakes of on the 3DS. I've had Majora's Mask 3D and um, and I've had the other one, but you know I've never I've never really owned a new one so. Um, so this is the, so this is the first. I uh, just wanted to let you guys know that um, since my uh, doctor's appointment, I've changed my diet a little bit. So I've been eating chicken and salad most of the day. Maybe changing my diet up a little bit to have maybe pizza or so. I actually had four pieces of pizza today. Um, but I'm going to go to bed. Uh, I'm going to walk around the house, maybe go on the treadmill for a little bit, and then I'm going to. Uh, tomorrow, and then I'm gonna uh, maybe take a walk after I get back from home from work, because I'm not really gonna be going to the convenience stores anymore. I vetoed that, so I'm currently at so currently the I'm currently at two twenty, two twenty, which is the lowest I've been in a long time. Um, I'm currently at two twenty. Um, I think I've been far. I think I've been as I think I've been as low as two eighteen. 218 I think because I eat some more I think I ate a lot of stuff I didn't want to today so um I didn't eat any I didn't eat too much sugar um I just drank water and all this other stuff I tried to flush all the stuff on my system so yeah I was 221 um I was 221 when I got back home so I and I and I think the pizza kind of ballooned me a couple of pounds but I think um I think me I think after I flush everything out of my system, I think I'll be the last, but, um, but I just feel a lot more energetic, and I, this is not something I'm not going to go through, um, this is not something I'm going to get through cardio, I guess, the, um, I'm not going to get through cardio, it's, it's like me, um, eating light, and, um, actually losing the weight, so, it is I am successful in losing the weight. I just can't order anything. I just can't order any more fast food. See, what I've done is I'm either eating. See, tomorrow morning when I get up, usually, usually my Saturday is like this. Usually at seven thirty. Usually at ten o'clock, ten nine thirty, ten o'clock. Usually I get. Usually I get some from Dunkin' Donuts. I have brought to the store, and that's gonna stop because it's becoming a pattern, and I don't want to do that. Um, what I'm going to, what I do most mornings is I either eat oatmeal or I have an egg or I have fresh toast. I might have oatmeal tomorrow, um, and have, might have some milk 
and some stuff like that. But that's to just get my regiment down because I have to fit into a suit. Um, I'm going to do this very slowly because if you lose too much weight too fast, your body might not catch up with the difference and you might change a little bit. But I do feel like I actually have more energy. I feel like I don't have to crave chocolate as much. I, I feel like I don't have to dive for, for a candy bar or a soda or an energy drink because um, energy drinks and all that other stuff is going to be very wasteful. So I'm going to change my lifestyle and I'm going to test my body just to make sure it's not completely starved of uh, bad things. But um, uh, so I am. Um, so yeah, I, uh, I, you know, I got home today. I had some, I had a piece of, I made some pizza in the, I had a couple pieces then I put it back and then uh, I might have a hot dog tomorrow. I might have some salad that I have that I have left over from from today so that I ate some of the salad because I was really busy today with work and doing all this other stuff um and I think it's 12 o'clock now so yeah I just wanted to tell you guys that yeah I'm doing good I didn't want to do any gameplay tonight because I didn't um because I just didn't want to do it. I just wanted to talk to you guys. I want to talk to you guys via 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 the uh, via the phone. Um, I officially um, am going to have that paid off by July, and I'm going to stick with the eleven for a bit. Um, I'm not going to trade it in or anything because I don't because I don't think a new phone is. I just got finished paying one off. I'm gonna I'm gonna enjoy having to pay twenty seven less dollars on the bill, so my bill will go down to like. It will go down like twenty dollars, so it'll go down like ninety, ninety, ninety to maybe eighty five. As soon as I pay it off, um, and I'm not going to get a new one because that means I'll just have to pay another twenty dollars, and it's that's twenty dollars I don't want to give Verizon because I think that allows the lousy out. And the reason why I'm saying that, guys, is because it took me forever to get this phone from them at the dealership. And giving them another twenty-seven or thirty or forty dollars just for a new one is kind of bad. Um, if I buy one of these again, it's going to be outright, and it's going to be like a base one, maybe for like eight, nine hundred dollars in the future. I'm probably not going to get. I'm just going to say this right now. I'm probably not going to get one till maybe after the fifteen gets revealed or something like that. So. So if you guys see me with a 15, I may get a 15, but, um, got a bike in the background. I thought there was somebody yelling in the back, backyard. Um, so yeah, um, but yeah, guys, I just want to tell you guys that uh, thank you for the support. I know this month has been a little low for us. Um, I'm going to try to do that. Uh, Indianapolis um, fast time practice today was actually very good. I'm going to report on that a little bit because you guys know me. I like Indianapolis. I like the 500 and the, I like cars that go 230 miles an hour. So the uh, I think the fastest time was set by a uh, Honda at a 234.731. Um Qualifying begins tomorrow. Also, the Nurburgring 24 is tomorrow. So I'm going to definitely watch that. That's probably going to start around 10 o'clock tomorrow because they they usually start in the afternoon. Uh, they usually start 2, 3 o'clock, which is probably going to be about 10, 11 o'clock Eastern. Um, I'm hoping that they have get the whole race in and that they don't have any fog. You know, I, it seems to be like going that way. So, um, and stuff like that, which is great. Um, so yeah, I, so yeah, I'm, look for me to talk about Indy 500. I'll, on Saturday, I may record, I may show you guys, uh, I actually I can't record it because it's on TV, but I'll, but I'll let you guys know, but I'll let you guys, um, But I'll let you guys know. Um, but I'll let you guys know what happened, and as soon as I will 
as soon as it finishes. I know if the past six, fin uh, the past six finishes at five or six o'clock on Sunday, I'll report to you guys who actually won the poll. And then we'll wait till next week to, for me to reveal the Indy 500. Um, so I'm actually going to do a gear change show tomorrow since I meant to do a gear change show on turbos and Indy. Um, Indy turbo supercharging. I'm going to do that's going to be my gear change show tomorrow. I'm going to try to record it at five and release it at six or seven. Um, uh, after I go for a walk and to do a bunch of stuff, but. I hope you guys are ready for some racing this weekend. Um, IMSA was kind of a letdown last weekend, and Formula One wasn't there. Um, also, they're going to be doing the All-Star Race at North Wilkesboro on... Um, they're also going to be doing... Uh, they were at Darlington last week with an interesting race. They're going to be at North Wilkesboro for the All-Star Race. Um, uh tomorrow uh not tomorrow but sunday so i'm definitely going to be watching that um i'm going to be watching the nerve ring 24 i'm going to tell you guys the live i'll give you guys live um i'll give you guys what i thought of, what i think about the um all-star race i'm going to try to find out what time it is and i'll tell you guys what's happening with the um if i can want to give you all the updates about the uh nerve ring um but yeah um I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I'm going to upload it as soon as I'm done here. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys then. And um, peace out. I hope you guys enjoyed this. This is episode 63. I think this is episode 433 of the uh, uh, in total. So we're almost at half distance. And we're almost at there. Um, if we can get to almost 70 by May, and we can get through 80-something, and uh, if we can get to 100 by July, if we can get to 100, if we can get to 100-something by July, that'd be great, because we're already doubled, we've already doubled the, um, because we, we've already doubled last year's count, and, um, the water doubled last year's count, and I'm pretty sure we're gonna get into the, to the high hundreds, and then we're gonna have six more months worth of 25 more days so 25 times six i'm pretty sure you guys can do the math it's well over 150 so we're definitely maybe could get into the 200s but at the by this year and i'm definitely going to cover miles's wedding and all this other stuff but we're definitely going to get into the hundreds this year we're definitely passing 100 and 120 some more this year. I'm going to make sure I record a lot every day. And I'm going to make sure to tell you what what's going on with this. And stuff like that. So if you guys enjoyed this. And as you, as always. Mike Camo's Automotive Radio Show. I'm going to be tomorrow. I'm going to be here tomorrow for the Gear Change Show. I hope you guys enjoy. Peace out.